Huawei is preparing something big with the Mate 80 series, and the main highlight this time is AI. The company is working on a brand new Kirin chip that's expected to unlock a whole new level of AI features. This isn't just about a faster processor, it's about smarter performance and a deeper integration between hardware and software. Leaks suggest that Huawei has been focusing heavily on chip-level AI technology for its next flagship. That means the new Kirin chip won't just handle everyday tasks better, but it will also allow the Mate 80 to perform more advanced, intelligent functions directly on the device. Instead of relying only on cloud-based AI, more processes can run locally, giving users faster, smarter, and more private experiences. At the same time, Huawei is preparing Harmony OS 6.0. This will be the first major software version fully built to take advantage of the new Kirin chip. The Mate 80 series will likely be the first to show how both sides, hardware and software, work together to deliver these upgraded AI experiences. Huawei has already been pushing AI in its current phones with Harmony OS 5.0, but the next generation is said to take things much further. To put it simply, Huawei is strengthening both its hardware and software at the same time. The combination is what will unlock these advanced AI features for the Mate 80. It's the same strategy the company used with the Mate 70 series, where Harmony OS worked hand-in-hand -hand with the Kirin chip to boost efficiency and overall performance. But this time, the improvements are expected to be on a much larger scale. Now, let's talk numbers. According to reports, the new Kirin chip in the Mate 80 series has been optimized for better power consumption. That's a huge deal because one of the biggest challenges for modern smartphones is balancing raw performance with battery efficiency. Early information even suggests that this Kirin chip could outperform the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, which powered many flagship phones not long ago. On top of that, the new chip is said to deliver around 20% better performance compared to the Kirin 9025G. That kind of jump means smoother multitasking, faster app launches, improved gaming, and of course, more efficient AI processing. If true, the Mate 80 series could feel significantly faster and smarter than the Mate 70 lineup. One area where AI could really shine is Huawei's digital assistant, Celia. The leaks hint that Celia might get a big refresh with smarter and more natural interactions. Think about voice recognition that feels quicker, translation that happens instantly, and camera features that automatically adjust settings for the best possible shot. AI could also play a role in improving security, system management, and even battery life optimization. But Huawei's strategy isn't only about keeping up with rivals like Apple and Samsung. Since the company has faced restrictions when it comes to high-end chip manufacturing, it has turned that challenge into an opportunity by making its software stronger than ever. Harmony OS has already proven it can stand independently from Android, and with version 6.0, it looks like Huawei is ready to push the boundaries further. This balanced approach, enhancing both the Kirin hardware and the Harmony OS platform, is what gives Huawei an edge. Instead of relying only on raw chip power, the company is building a system where both sides complement each other. That's why the Mate 80 series could end up feeling more efficient and innovative than just the numbers suggest. When can we expect the Mate 80 series? Reports point to a launch around late October or early November this year. Development is moving quickly, and Huawei might make an official announcement sooner than expected. Given the company's recent track record, it's clear that it wants to make a big statement with this release. To sum it up, the Mate 80 series is shaping up to be one of Huawei's most ambitious projects yet. A brand new Kirin chip, smarter on-device AI, Harmony OS 6.0, and a potential refresh of Celia. All these pieces together show that Huawei is betting big on artificial intelligence. With 20% better performance over the previous generation and improved efficiency, the Mate 80 could be a major leap forward for the company. So, while other brands are talking about AI as the future, Huawei is building it directly into the heart of its devices. The Mate 80 series might just prove that AI-driven smartphones are not a distant idea. They're arriving sooner than we think.